earlier this year, Mercedes rolled out their ADTR or Avatar concept vehicle. The all-electric 469 horsepower car is inspired by the 2009 movie Avatar and eventually the sequels to the movie that are supposedly been in the works for like the last decade, better part 10 years anyways. In addition to a sleek body design with a huge windshield and transparent doors, the interior of the vehicle features no steering wheel or pedals. Rather, the driver is, quote, connected to the car via an interactive joystick-like controller on the center console. Instead of turning a key, the driver places his or her hand on this control pad, with functions like accelerating, braking, and steering performed by moving the hand on this central console. According to a report on Business Insider, the pad pulsates with every move, much like horse or mountain banshee would in responding to its rider. Representing a growing trend on concept cars, the traditional dashboard is replaced by a large infotainment screen that curves around the entire front cabin. Among other information, the display offers real-time footage of the road ahead. One of the most unique features is found on the vehicle's exterior in the form of 33 bionic flaps on the back of the car that light up with different colors to indicate when the vehicle is accelerating, braking, or turning. From a mechanical perspective, the Avatar offers a motor at each of the four wheels and a graphene-based battery that can deliver a driving range of up to 435 miles after receiving a full charge in as few as 15 minutes. The lack of lithium and cobalt in the battery's composition is seen as being more environmentally friendly. Spherical wheels mesh with two independently moving axles, which allow the car to do sort of a sideways walk to help maneuver in tight spaces. Mercedes has no current plans to commercialize the Avatar concept, but the battery and wheel design are technologies that the company wants to continue enhancing for potential use within the next five years. For Thomas, I'm David Manti, and this is the Thomas Industry Update.